joined by outfielder Ryan Page. Ryan, I, I thought for the better part of that first game, I, I just didn't like our energy, really. And then we're down to our final three outs. I, I see Coach Burdett getting the team fired up, uh, and we get three runs. You get a two-run double in that bottom of the ninth. Take us through that sequence and obviously uh, coming up with a clutch hit. So, yeah, uh, energy levels were definitely down, um, but we've been doing that a lot in the first game of these double headers. So we just need guys to step up, um, do their job, follow the approach, and hit the ball hard whenever they can. And that, uh, obviously, a, a big-time situation for you. Take us through what's, uh, what's going through your mind as uh, they, they trotted out three pitchers in that ninth inning, and we got a hold of all of them. Uh, I'd be lying if I said I wasn't thinking about how uh, – if I don't get a hit here, it's probably game over, but um, I was just thinking about follow the approach and do what I do every at-bat, which is uh, fight hard. We get a sweep against Hiram, and now, uh, you know, a couple days, DePaul's going to come to town, and uh, what's going to be the key for us to get off to a, a good start and, you know, try to transition it throughout, you know, both games? Just keep the energy that we left the field with today. Um, just try and make sure we come out swinging. Uh, don't let ourselves fall behind, fall behind early in game one. Uh, and just keep moving along joined now by senior Matt Contreras who hits the walk-off two-run homer in game one against Hiram. Okay Matt, obviously we get a little late inning rally going on and then it comes down to you uh, essentially at the uh, at the end there in the 11th. Yeah. Take us what's uh, going through your mind in this at bat and obviously a walk-off homer is pretty special. Yeah, so I was just looking for a fastball. I mean that's the approach that Coach Burdett preaches and he pretty much threw it high and away. I uh, put a good swing on it. Honestly, I thought it was going to get caught in front of the uh, center field fence, but he just kept going back and back, jumps over, thought he caught it, but then once he just hit the ground, I mean, I just kept running and my teammates were going nuts, and that's when I knew it just went over. So I'm just so happy uh, that we were just able to get this win. Matt, uh, Zach Alsawi was working up in the press box today, and he, he kind of turned around to the sports information people and thought, we got to figure out a way to play start to finish in both games. What's going to be the key for us uh, with DePaul coming to town this weekend? I think just bringing the intensity game one. Uh, we're a game two team, um, as, we, as you can see. So um, game one, we just got to bring the intensity. We got to bring the energy and just keep it all the way through nine innings.